Assalamu alaikum guys, welcome back. This is Shafat Khan on your screen. I'm back with a very important video and this video is purely for medical research. Okay, this is purely related to medical research and is specifically targeted for MBBS students. So let's get started. All right guys, so in this video I'm going to talk about a very special organization which is run by uh, Dow alumni. Okay. Uh, it's known as ARCOP, Research Council of Pakistan, which was set up to facilitate students like us, like me and you, to thrive in research, okay, uh, in medical research, so let's get started. Alright guys, so a few days ago I talked about research slightly in one of my videos in which I did recommend ARCOP and attending the ARCOPS level 1 and uh, meta-analysis workshops which I myself personally attended, okay. Now, why am I making this video? The reason there are a few reasons for them, so I'm quickly gonna explain them and then move on. Basically, the first reason is that I've been um, the arc of level one workshop will be commencing on the third of April. It's gonna be for two days, third and fourth of April. Okay. Then, secondly, I've been receiving questions regarding this workshop from many of my juniors as well as my colleagues, my peers who are at the same level as me, asking whether they should join it or not, whether is it too early or too late for them to join, or should is it a right thing to do, or is it good enough to pay for it and get stuff like this. So basically, I'm gonna, uh, that's the second reason I'm gonna address all of these questions in this video. And thirdly, I've been, uh, luckily I uh, got the ARCOP team, basically they approached me, Dr. Tariq from ARCOP, who actually took our level one workshop, uh, Dr. Tariq and Dr. Sharik and Dr. Kaniz and Dr. Shazib also. Uh, these are four people basically. Dr. Shazib is the founder of ARCOP and uh, he's currently studying at Duke. Uh, uh, Dr. Tariq and Sharik, they actually conducted our workshops in uh, the level one workshop and the meta-analysis workshop, which I personally took. So Dr. Tariq, he personally reached out to me and uh, requested me to make a video not for their promotion, but rather to to share with you guys my own personal experience, which I myself had from Arcop. So that's exactly the major reason why I'm making this video. So let's begin. All right, guys. So basically, why uh, research? First of all, let's just quickly make a background before addressing the major questions. So I did. Uh, talk about research slightly in one of my videos previously. I uh, remember that video in which I talked, I gave an answer regarding USMLE to a, uh, to a student, all right? So basically research will actually help you out a lot, especially for your CV building. If you have strong research, very good research in your CV, then that will actually help strengthen your CV a lot and will help you give an edge over the others, okay? Especially because the step one score is no more, okay? It, it won't be counted after 2022. So if the step one is removed, then the other stuff, stuff other than the scores would be taken into consideration, right? The step two CK might replace step one or stuff like research, research will actually give you an edge over there, okay? While you are giving your interview, we'll have something to talk about. While you are preparing for, um, for the steps or for the USMLE or for clearing that you will definitely need research but that's just one way of thinking the importance of research okay of, uh, of learning about research okay that's just one factor why you should be doing research there are multiple other reasons why you should be doing research secondly you should at least know how to read a research okay research papers are not just like some ordinary books or our medical books and just reading them. No, there's a whole different methodology of reading it, okay? So this is what you will be learning from the workshop ARCOP. I had no idea before attending this level one workshop about the research at all. Well, what I did, I was just like that in the ARCOP workshop. I was just like that, I was just like research, I was just research, I was just like that, seniors, I was research, I was research, I was just like that, I was just like that, so I was just like that. What I realized after going there was that I took a very, very important decision of going there and it was a very good decision. Because if I didn't know about research at all and after going there, I learned almost everything about research and I'm confident enough to write my own paper, inshallah. Okay, so basically, uh, well, of course, foreign you So for that, you need a lot of practice, okay? And 
that's what the re arc of that's where the arc of comes in okay this don't consider this to be a two day workshop no this is this won't be a two day workshop reason is because these uh, these guys are seniors uh, dr tariq dr sharik and other seniors they won't be just there for these two days but rather they'll be available through their facebook page through their uh, other social media accounts through their twitter etc where they will be addressing your questions they are addressing my questions till date okay till now they, uh, it has been like two months i think for two to three months when i took their workshop three months okay i think i took it in january so two months two to three months approximately so i took it then and i'm doing it now i'm doing my research now and i'm still asking them questions and they are still currently replying me okay so that's where the important thing comes in that you get mentors to guide you okay apart from that uh, research will also help you if you stay back in pakistan because if you want to become a professor or if you want to get, gain better ranks of course you might know this already that research will actually give you that advantage then coming now what are they going to teach you in the level 1 workshop and what did i myself learn from the level 1 workshop was that uh, before going i told you that i had no idea at all as soon as i attended the workshop i knew what research actually was why i needed research okay what research was and why i needed research and uh, research can look very very daunting if you haven't started one yet and of course it's going to be very very daunting but the best thing to do is persevere okay this is what they actually tell you and this is what you must know that you have to persevere in order to uh, publish or in order to become a very a published researcher okay apart from that they will also be teaching you the methodology of research which i myself learned okay basically and they'll be the best thing about them is that they'll be starting out from scratch okay because it's level 1 right it's just one is the first level there are other levels as well level 2 level 3 right but this in this workshop they'll be starting out from scratch so one of those questions which my juniors asked was that i'm i'm i know nothing about research and um, will it be good for me to attend it or i won't understand anything so the answer to that is well listen they'll be starting out from the basics from the scratch and they won't make it very complicated by the way all the research is quite can look quite complicated for the, especially when you are looking at, at it uh, for the first time they'll try to make it as simple as possible this is what they actually did for me okay but the thing is okay you should go okay that's what i would recommend this is just a recommendation of course not a hard and fast rule but uh, the final decision would be on you but this is my recommendation you should go because i learned about research i learned the importance of research i learned the methodology of research i okay and now the coming to the most important thing about research and that is building contacts okay you need strong contacts if you want to get into usmle or if you want to match into some good uh, us uh, university and uh, or into some good college into some good program okay so you need strong contacts and you will be making that through research by doing research with the international researchers from the us and and the best thing about arcop is that they'll act as the medium or the facilitators for connecting you guys with them okay because they have strong links with them dr shahzeb himself is in duke university okay currently he he got he recently got uh, an acceptance from duke okay, all right and um, so that's how you are gonna and they are the art of people the best thing about them is that they are actually trying to make a big network okay a network in which of researchers so if you have a big network you will be able to collaborate with one another and you will make good contacts very quickly right so that's the best thing which i think you guys will get from arco because see you might get to know about research from other people as well from other places as well but these guys themselves have published papers dr shari almost 80 plus publications dr shahzeb 200 plus publications dr tariq a lot of publication and stuff like that right so guys these guys already have experience they know their work so that's why i'm recommending them otherwise you might uh, see some other people doing the research as well of course but uh, when wherever you go kindly do check if they are published authors or not in the pubmed index okay uh, but you will get to know about that as well while you will be attending the level 1 workshop so you will get to know what to follow what not to follow what to do what not to do etc if you are a fresher uh, a fresh person a fresh student especially the mbbs first year students okay now 
this is a very important advice for those students from, from MBBS uh, first year, my juniors basically, who uh, texted me, like I received almost around 10 people texting me uh, recently, yesterday I think, asking the same question, is it good for me to join it or not? Uh, I mean like, is it good for them? Will they be able to understand it? Is it too, too early or too late? Guys, remember one thing, it's never too early in research. Okay, it's, it's, it's always too late in research. <laughs> Just kidding. Not always too late, but right, like I myself, I started out research right now uh, in the beginning of second year. Why? Because I didn't know about Arkov in the beginning of my first year, okay? And I regret that. Actually, now you guys know about Arkov through my videos so from your first year, so do check it out, do join it, okay? Do not uh, waste time because the earlier you get enrolled or the earlier you get involved in research, the earlier you will, uh, there's a high chance that the earlier you will yield results. Okay, not always the case because sometimes the research might take a lot of time, but still you might get a hold of it. You might get familiarized or habitual with the surroundings of research and what to do in research. You might develop the skill of research. My own friend, uh, Samir Arshad, uh, basically, uh, Samir, if you're looking, uh, if you're hearing this, this is for you. He also started out from uh, first year, okay, and during first year, he, he was actually, he loves research, okay? Uh, and he signed out from first year. And in first year, he met Dr. Tariq, okay, through Facebook group. And from there, he started working with him. And now he's currently a published PubMed uh, author. Although he has published just one, uh, his first article yet, but still he is a PubMed index author, right? So through this workshop, uh, you will actually learn the basics of research, and you will actually learn how to get published and you will get an edge. Uh, okay, not uh, the edge might not come through only this workshop, you might need a lot of other training as well, like the meta-analysis workshop, etc. But the best thing is you'll build up contacts and the best thing is you'll get a chance to interact with these people who already published, right? They've learned a lot of stuff through trial and error and they'll be explaining that in this ARCOP workshop, okay? Then, uh, some important things which I have noted down over here. I know this is becoming a bit lengthy, but it's worth taking, worth talking about. All right, guys, uh, they'll be starting from scratch. We've talked about that. They'll get in, okay, get involved in research as early as uh, possible. I talked about that as well. Even the first year, the MBBS first year students, kindly do not miss this workshop. Go and attend it, okay? I recommend it. Then, Although it is early, it doesn't matter. Early is good, okay? You'll get involved in it early. You'll get to know about well-known researchers more earlier, okay? And there's a high chance that you'll get published in some good journals very soon, inshallah. Okay, and there is, well, um, I cannot say if you'll get published directly to some very high-tier journals, of course, because I myself have been published it as well. But you'll definitely get to know about research, okay? Then, uh, while you are taking the workshop, I myself, what I did was took notes and that was actually quite helpful, okay? What I did was that I, now, those notes are actually helping me right now. I took the workshop a few months ago, but now I'm revising them whenever I'm doing some research with my work, uh, with my friends, basically. So I just pull out those notes, just review them, and then just make notes. Okay, so do make very good notes. Okay, do not mess them up. Make very good notes. They will actually provide some material as well, some sample uh, articles, some sample work which they actually put together, but making your own handwritten notes is the best option, okay? Do make good notes. Then, uh, because they'll help you out later on. Uh, all right, and you'll also get lifelong mentors, okay? Basically for research, they are quite busy. They will, uh, they still reply me. Like, it has been almost three months, but whenever I have a question regarding my own research, which I'm doing, which is unrelated to them, has no benefit to them but still they do reply okay so this is how a network is actually building so that's why I'm actually quite satisfied with their performance with the with the level one workshop especially and uh, a very important point that I've written over here is that this research not many people know about research okay especially the undergraduate research not many people know about it the postgraduate research there might be quite a lot of people knowing about that but I, I doubt if most of the people know about that as well because it is quite uh, a challenging thing to do, quite a daunting thing to start out. There is very limited uh, resources, there are very limited resources available for research and ARCOP is one of them, okay? One of the limited and one of the best 
uh, resource available for research, okay? You might not find other people or other resources like our comp. You might find some uh, some stuff on Google or some stuff on YouTube, etc. But still, like all the stuff through trial and error, which they collected, they gathered, and they they, get, they, deliver, they try delivering it to you. So that's why I just recommended it, especially for the first year students. And apart from that, is uh, I think all of this is covered, right? So if this is covered, then that's it, guys. Bus uh, yeh hai. Arcop level one ki workshop le lena zaroor. Theek hai and yeah, that's it. Thank you.